Hi, I'm Daniel Thorpe. I'm applying for the position of online course facilitator. I believe, based on my previous experience teaching Introduction to Physiology, Human Physiology 100 and 101, Physiology Essentials and Second Year Physiology, I'd be great at engaging and encouraging learning for online students. I'm always enthusiastic when I'm teaching students and I have a genuine interest in them. I find it's very important to develop that relationship and show an interest uh, to engage them in learning. It's also important to be relatable and for the course information uh, to be relatable to them uh, currently, as well as part of their future careers. And I feel that it's very important to demonstrate this while you're teaching, otherwise there'll be a lack of engagement due to this. When I'm teaching, I try and be very positive, especially with critical feedback. I feel that if you give critical feedback in the correct way and make it a positive experience, you're more likely to achieve student outcomes and keep students encouraged and interested in the courses you're teaching. I also feel that goals are very important to set. While you can have large goals and they're important to try and achieve, like completing a course, it's also important to have smaller goals to set so that you're encouraged each time you do that. One of the ways you can achieve this is by breaking up lectures into smaller sections. So a two hour lecture could just be in 20 minute sections and it's far easier to go and look at a 20 minute lecture here and there and get through it all than to know you're going to be stuck there listening to two hours worth of lectures. Finally, I feel it's important to have multiple ways to learn, so multiple opportunities to learn. It's great to have text. It's also important to provide pictures because some people learn better with pictures and some people prefer a forum situation where you can discuss a topic with each other and give them constructive help or feedback on this. It's also important to continue to learn afterwards, so to have lifelong learning on a topic. And in this regards, I'm providing this YouTube link, which will give you further opportunity to learn about me. Thank you.